And to my colleagues, especially the ones that keep introducing amendments that are a tangent and a distraction from what we're talking about, you all are white males, you never lived in my shoes, and you do not know what it's like to be an African-American male. And all I'm saying is, if you are opposed to this legislation, let's just have the vote. But please do not come in this committee room and make a mockery of the pain that exists in my community. Will the gentleman yield? Sure. I appreciate your passion. Are you suggesting that you're certain that none of us have non-white children? Be because you, you reflected on your black son and you said none of us could understand. Matt, Matt, stop. I'm not about to get sidetracked about the color of our children. We're talking no, about said, black kids. I reclaim my time. You said that you I reclaimed my time. I but know you want the discussion. I know the that gentlemen, you want a bill? gentlemen reclaimed his time. I said I claim reclaim my time. I already know that there are people on the other side that have uh, black grandchildren. It is not about the color of your kids. It is about black males, black people in the streets How do that you are getting killed. And if one of them happens to be your kid, I'm concerned about him, too. And clearly, I'm more concerned about him than you are. So, so let's be clear you're, about you're that. Claiming, so you're claiming you're I more am, concerned for my family than I do? Who in the hell do you are? The gentleman, the gentleman, if the, the shoe... I don't know how much the we care about our families. Kick this dog is outrageous. Holler. You should take those words down. The I do care will about your family and love your family. The gentleman we, will suspend... It. The gentleman will suspend. The time belongs to the gentleman from Louisiana. Cedric, would you yield... Was, was that a nerve? Yeah, uh, you damn right it was a nerve. I yield to the gentleman from Louisiana. I say this, honestly.